Look, there's a thing in our box. What's in the mailbox? Yep, oh, wait. We got a bonus for we the hunt. In hunter rank. Oh, we got the double sub barrel. That'll be useful at some point. I don't remember what that means, but I think that's probably helpful. End of the chapter. Meh. Nah. This ring is a symbol. It is a symbol of Zenith's vow of eternal loyalty to you. God damn it, he married the clock god. <laughs> Congratulations! How does it feel? Mazel tov. How does it feel Tick. to have a god at your command? Talk. You never say anything else! I look forward to seeing the fruit I hope they didn't follow the Jewish board. tradition of, of course. stepping on some glass. <laughs> what, with cords? <laughs> <laughs> oh god! <laughs> that that, could, that could be mistaken pretty easily. I go real poor. Something you as a cardinal must know all too well. Tell me, what is written in the last book of the scriptures? It's also like generic yeah. Catholicism. I know, right? So, very good. And what else? <laughs> I love how patronizing you be. Very good. <laughs> also and a cardinal, I have to say. The second coming? Who's Sybil? A subject well worth pursuing. I think they're calling Sybil a thing. Bastard! You'd use our dead prelate for a shield? You mustn't think that I don't trust you, Rowan. Not as effective as iron, I think. But once I've told you how to use the key, I'll only be a nuisance. We're in this world, Kevlar. Secrets. You understand. Iron wouldn't be very. Mm, you Kevlar mean, would be better. Yeah. Be very light. Could be reborn. Yeah, it's good. Stretchy. But also, the only weapons are guns. No. And grenades, which neither of those. That's are. Right, right, right. I can't accept it. I won't. Mind you, can Kevlar be poisoned? Certain. I speak only of possibilities. I don't know that anyone's the ever tried. <laughs> the history of time. A miracle. We should be going. Zenith awaits. They should have just made them twins. Would have been easier. They are twins. Look at them. They're not twins. The Look at them. They're they're very <laughs> annoyingly similar, but they're not <laughs> twins. To the next chapter. Have we ever actually done that before? Just gone right from like the cutscene. Like gone from one cutscene to the other. <laughs> Maybe I don't know. I don't actually know that we have. Which one should I save over this time? Um, what did we load? Just not the most recent one. How about the oldest one? Go for that. We already saved over the only Vacheron one, so it's no point. I know. I'm a dick, I'm sorry. I think I, I actually did I don't remember. No, I did it. Eh, it's from Teresa. She usually has someone else do it. It sounds like fun. Is think Teresa the, the boob lady? On their faces. Come no. on, kids are always happy when they get presents. If you ask me, I think it sets a bad precedent. You think so? Well, <sighs> work's work, isn't it? It's a good exciting. attitude to have, Zephyr. We'll be handing out presents this Christmas. Any objections? You're serious about this? What's with the I camera? Am. No back and Dutch. Out. Counter Dutch. Oh, man. Right then. We'll put the holly and the jolly into this show. They won't know what hit them. Easy. Let's not get carried away. Did they just leave a, a word out of his subtitles completely? Looks like they did. If you, if you hadn't guessed, guys, today is a very important day. CHRISTMAS! Christmas is here. It's not just near. It's no longer coming. It's, it's Christmas. Let's check the boards! Christmas time is here. Oh, we should sing some Christmas songs. Alright, what's your favorite Christmas song? That's a good question. I actually really like um what's that one? Ma da 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 that one. The one that's like kinda dark and spooky. Yeah, I really like that too. It's, uh, a, it's a good one. I, I don't know the words to it. It's called though. like Christmas Eve Sarajevo or something. I don't know. The board! Do 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 ding Ooh, a shockproof suit. I don't think I care. Alright, so uh The town's fashion movements have have slowed to a crawl. As the fashion opinion leader, I have to take charge. Like-minded helpers sought. 
slightly oddly phrased. I was tasked with exterminating monsters that appeared around Etsia on level 10? The Where's fuck that? is Etsia? I don't remember that, that at all. But damn it, I feel so useless. Can you knock out some manhole stoppers? Uh, whoa. Excuse me. <laughs> uh, you gonna buy me dinner first, sir? <laughs> There's a nasty infestation of pests stirring up trouble around Silver Canyon on uh, level 7. It's your favorite place. This is exactly how she sounds, by the way. Yeah. My boys found themselves outmatched, though. Uh, can you fry those nasties instead? So Cardinal Boobs is bar bar Barbarella. Barbarella, of way. course yeah. it is. Bar Barbarella. All right, so clearly we're going to save Christmas. Yeah. What should we do first? Should we, we should go see her, because she's right near here. And then maybe go see Barbarella. Are, are any of these actually, like, talking about the Christmas thing? No. What's up with that? I haven't looked that's at it. That's kind of weird. I haven't gone to that. That's a, that's a separate... Yeah, but usually that would still show up on the mission memo. That wasn't the mission memo. That was the board. Oh, that was just on the... Yeah, you're right. All right, so I'm going to go to talk to Fashion Lady. Yeah. Which means I have to go this way. Very good. Thank now, you. Now, do you remember what was in the last scriptures? <laughs> I don't know. That bothers me because, like, I'm pretty sure they're both cardinals. So, like, what the hell? Oh yeah, we still we have like a fucking doll from twenty years ago, don't we? Apparently not. He didn't take any. Really? I swear we never turned that in. I think we established the last time we tried that we don't actually have a doll on us. I don't think we ever tried. I think you're making that up. No, we did. Totally happened. Uh, mm, Something I remember that you don't. I don't think. See, the <laughs> fact that that is the alternative makes <laughs> me think that's even less likely. <laughs> have you noticed that fashion has gotten boring lately? Sure. Yeah, man. Seriously, we've been wearing these outfits forever. Uh, as the town's fashion leader, I think it's up to me to make a change. So I want to make a new statement outfit. Can you find some vulcanized, <laughs> vulcanized hide? hide? Let's see if we have any. What do I know about... Well, only that Alka told me before. You can harvest it on the lower levels, I think. <sighs> Who's Alcott? Alcott? The name sounds familiar, but I don't know. Are remember. you Alcott? No, you're Marjorie. Margie. Are you Alcott? No. That's boutique clerk, Ob. You never know. Uh, this makes me think we should go do that thing on level ten in Etsia. Yeah, probably. Is that that probably. probably coincides? Well, let's find Alcott first. Well, how do you propose we do that? I don't know. Talk to every person in town. Oh well, that seems like the most expedient solution. Claire. Papa Gremlin. What do we, we got? Four dollars uh -huh. U.S. Not as good as Elbona. Which sounds way dirtier than it ought to. <laughs> be Maybe Alcott's the old guy. No, that's Daniel. Nice Daniel. Are you gonna go tinker? Are you Alcott? Alcott might be in here. Alcott, yeah, actually. Oh, I know of it, but it won't be easy to get. They used to harvest it from junker behemoths, but they went extinct. Some Something may still about be that in seems Etsia like, on level ten. Yeah, I know it. Something about that concept seems like completely mind-boggling to me. Yeah, right. Like, like these horrible monsters on this floating sky city going extinct. It's just like I cannot wrap my head around that. Also, I don't think I'd be too sad about it. But so, what if you needed vulcanized hide? Why would she even ask for that if it comes from an extinct thing? Yeah, I know. Like, what the hell? All right, we're gonna. There, go that would be like someone like Louis Vuitton being like, "Oh man." I got this great idea for next season, <laughs> but I'm going to need, like, woolly mammoth tusks. Like, yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, all right, we're going to go up to Barbarella. 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 Meh, meh, meh. Why doesn't your apartment play this, like, violin music? That'd be sweet. Yeah. I'd like that. We'll get old real fast. <laughs> yeah, we'll get all old, right. like, crazy. All right, boob lady, what do you want? Reports say that your main dish consists of some bulky cargo walkers. They're being nuisances at five locations. Ugh. What the hell does she mean by dish? It's a weird use of that word. Alright. Uh, so what do we need to do now? We need to go down to level 10 and hopefully on the way uh, we'll check see Check the mission to see where that guy is that we need to talk to about Etsy. I guess, yeah, I guess he's at Elbona. Check Obama, also yeah. the Christmas party so we know where it is. Square Garden. Oh, we just go straight to Square Garden. So yeah, when we go there, it's on. It's on. <laughs> By the way, I never answered the Christmas Carol thing. Yeah. I have to think about that while we travel to level 10. Alright, so... Funny thing happened on the way to Albona. 
we found those things we were supposed to kill. Nice reference. Thanks. Sometimes I actually have wit. Other times I have to try really hard. That time I got lucky. Um, but yeah, we were talking about Christmas carols, and I was saying to Tech while we were walking that, like, uh, the one he referenced, which I don't fully know the name of, I think it's like Christmas Eve, Sarajevo, do 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 whatever. No, not that one. Uh, that's part of that song. Is it? It's later on. No. It is. Really? Promise. Never heard it that way. It's in there. All right. Um, but this it's one. also part of a different song, so it's not a good part to reference. But like, it's in there. Um, so what, the, what is that? What is that called? She said the name. I don't know. It's a something Walker. It's a crispy Walker. Mmm. Sure. <laughs> Spiffy beer cat. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah. So I think one of my favorite Christmas carols is like uh, the really sketchy Santa baby. You know, Santa oh baby? god. It's like the rapiest Christmas song. <laughs> I don't know why I like that. Santa baby. Oh god, it's so gross. Oh no, the the rapey one is uh cold outside. Oh. I like both of those. But I sort of blur them together as being the like really inappropriate Christmas carols. Right. I it actually stands to reason cuz I really like inappropriate like pop songs. Uh, like, Loving You by Enrique Iglesias. <laughs> Sexy Bitch by Akon. Yeah, those are good. Reference frequently. Um, but, like, I feel like those are both in line with that, and I like both of those. I, re I really like Cold Outside. Cold Outside is the worst, though. Or whatever that one's called. It's pretty rapey. Because it, it's, it's, she's like, oh, it's like winter, and if I don't go now, like, the roads will, like, kill me or whatever. And he's like, yeah, just stay here. <laughs> yeah, it's totally fine, yeah. bro. We'll just cuddle with our shirts off. It'll be <laughs> totally fine. Totes platonic. <laughs> if you ever say totes platonic to a girl, you are trying to date rape her. <laughs> I've decided. Um, but yeah. You know what's not a good Christmas song? What's that? Uh, well, for one, Dominic the Christmas Dog. <laughs> ching it the ching <laughs> 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 Italian Christmas donkey? What about that is festive? And, uh, I mean, there's a donkey. Donkeys eh. are gross. Donkeys are gross. Mermaids are weird. <laughs> Where do they poop? <laughs> do the question they poop? is, do they poop? <laughs> how right, do they reproduce, I suppose, is also a question. It's more of this junk. Web, 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 web. Also, whatever the... I don't know the name of this one either. The thing is, like... When I when I'm like home for Christmas with my family, like we're just like always listening to like Christmas Carol like XM or whatever. So it's just like Christmas carols all the time. So like after a while they just sort of bled together. Yeah, they're as all being, sort of like, one long song. Yeah. Like I know the distinct parts of them, but like I lose sight of the names. I certainly don't know who performs most of them, although a lot of them are done like infinitely. Yeah. Um but, like, whatever the one is where the kid's talking about, like, wanting a hippopotamus for Christmas, that just <laughs> sounds awful. Like, not only is it also not festive, but, like, the kid has, like, such a shrill voice. Yeah. It's just like, oh, I don't want to listen to you. I hear that uh, hippopotami are actually very violent creatures. Oh, yeah, no. Uh, aren't they, like, the most... They're, like, technically the most dangerous, like, animal in Africa. Yeah, they they're, like, the most super ter ter territorial. And they, if you like go anywhere near them, they will eat you. Also, apparently, they sweat red when they're angry. Oh my god, that's horrible. I don't know how you determine that on, a, on an animal that lives underwater. But apparently it's a thing. I don't know, maybe maybe, maybe they experimented on Hippowdons. Hippo what now? Hippowdons. Is that a Pokemon? Yes, it is. <laughs> of course. <laughs> good instinct. Good <laughs> instinct. <sighs> They're really good because they have the sandstream ability. That means when oh. they enter the field, a sandstorm starts and doesn't end until something ends it. Normally, when you just use the move sandstorm, it ends after like three to five turns. Uh huh. Do I want this thing? Well, if you make your Pokemon team the right way, then it's super helpful. For one, it doubles the special defense of rock type Pokemon. <laughs> oh, and good. It deals damage like gradually to any Pokemon that is not rock, ground, or steel type. Oh, this is what I've always wanted. I have to get this well, guy. Well, see, now I know what to get you for Christmas. <laughs> well, I hope you get on that, because it's here. Oh, I don't know. There's a whole lot of Christmas left to give. 
Guns, 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 guns. Crazy flying. Oh, hey, shout out to uh, Alcadius, apparently Al our number one Zero. fan. He, I think at this point he's earned title number one fan. Totes. Uh, for making us some cool fan art. Here's a picture. Yeah, it's so cool. Isn't it sweet? Yeah, if you follow me on Twitter, or I think also Tech, I think you retweeted it. I retweeted it, yeah. But I was, I was like, I was all over showing the world. Um, I realized, though, hmm. I tried to, uh, in, in making some Chiron, uh, I tried to flip your your head around so that we'd both be facing the same way. Yeah. For that, uh, for the Halo one. And yeah. I realized that I proportioned your eyes completely backwards. In the drawing. I can sort of picture what you mean. I haven't so paid like, close attention to it. You're, the eye that's far away from the quote-unquote camera is, like really big. is really big, and the <laughs> eye closer is really small. <laughs> so it looks really awful if you try to reverse it. it. For some reason, it looks fine that way. But that's if you weird. flip it around, it looks terrible. I don't know. That's, uh, that's interesting. So, uh, that's a weird one. Fun little fact there. Yeah. Uh, also, props to him for... He, he's made numerous references to understanding my my references to Yu-Gi-Oh! and Cardfight Vanguard. Which is... He, he knows what Psy Quali is. That's... I want to be his friend. I Good for him, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Do you know what Psy Quali is? I, I, I think so. It's like being able to determine a like, completely it's useless so thing. In the, in the new season, it's gotten so ridiculous. Like you, you can, like, guess what your next card is, right? Wow. No, you know what your next card okay. is. Okay. You literally see your draws for like the entire game, which like, and theirs. Like you just know everything that's gonna happen. Did you see what happened just now? It didn't look good. I wasn't paying close attention. I, mean, I, I was busy shouting about Psyqualia. I don't think it matters. Oh cool! I didn't know you could do that. Why would you want to do, do what? That? Switch to one gun. We had this discussion on camera. You are the okay. worst. Okay, <laughs> we talk about things all the time. I don't remember any of them. I know, <laughs> but you're the worst, and you think that you remember something better than me. I just don't believe it. Um, but, like, the the worst thing about the new season of Cardfight Vanguard, despite the fact <laughs> that they're trying to bring uh, Psyqualia back, even though they totally wrapped that storyline up, mm -hmm. is um, in order to justify making new decks and, like, having people give a crap about them... That didn't work. Um, they've stopped making cards for the two main, like, or the three main tribes, uh, Royal Paladins, Kagero, and Shadow Paladins, which were, like, what all the main characters use. Right. And so, like, the, the reason they've, they've justified this is, like, some weird interdimensional magic child appeared to them in dreams, beat mm. them at card fights, and then erased all trace of the existence of the cards that they used to play with. So nobody remembers that they used to play with a different deck, but their deck is completely changed, and they can't do anything about it. Interesting. It makes no sense. Weird. Alright, so these all are, are exactly the same, so I'm gonna do these two and then we'll uh, we'll meet you back here afterwards. Okay. <laughs> so just love your your immediate reaction to hip out on like, is that a Pokemon? <laughs> <laughs> Real sub barrel sounds really good. Big success. We did it. Go check what that does. But look. Customize, customize. Customize. It's too confused constantly. Yeah, just check it out on this. So, double sub barrel we just got as well. Rail sub barrel. This is pretty sweet. Ooh, double sub barrel does seem useful. Rail sub barrel definitely has some application somewhere. Oh my god. <laughs> what? <laughs> this game is so ridiculous. What are you talking about? Ah. If I had a handgun, this is the model I would get. This one? That one. Yeah, that, that one. Alright, uh, where are we going to next? Uh, we were on our way down to 10. Level 10. If we do that, we can check the boards when we get there to see what mission replaced killing those crispy walkers. <laughs> crispy walkers? I think that's what we determined they were called. <laughs> Is that like a, it's like an Asian dish? <laughs> Probably. Yeah, like an order of uh, the crispy walkers, please? With the orange glaze, of course. Alright, another one bites the dust. Alright, so we need to go down to level 10. Core lift 3 takes us, yeah, to 10. Does it? Yeah, we're on 9. Look at that. It's the one with the Froud Remnants. The Froud Remnants! We should go to there. What, in real life? Yeah. For realsies? Totes. What, what's the, uh... What's, like, the airfare rate for, um... Traven, traveling to, to the Sky Town of Basel? What do you think? I don't know. You think it's easy or hard to land on a Sky Town? 
considering the way it's constructed, I'd say incredibly difficult. There's not a lot of straightaways. Yeah, it's true. Maybe if you had a hex-shaped plane. I don't think plane. it's so much the placement. Like, it, it's just like, there, there's just not enough space to, like, stop the plane. And it looks like we don't even have to talk to that guy. Do we want to talk to that guy? Eh. Because we could just knock him out and then check the boards and get two missions. Because, like, his thing is basically just kill the stuff in the distance, right? Yeah, let's do it. It's four of them. They've created an impenetrable barrier of not-so-random encounters. I love that there were literally random encounters where you're standing right now, like last chapter or something. Yeah. And now they're just like, well, ten feet away, that's the next place we should put some. Two boxes? Holy crap. Fuck. I got some more smash grenades, which is good, because we apparently can't make those. And they're really sweet. Yeah, there's Ezio. What the heck? Did he say by Ezio or in Ezio? Because, like, this is clearly what we're supposed to do. Yeah, I don't Just know. Just kill them. Let's do them. Let's do them? I don't want to do them. Do them. Oh, um. Let's see what they are first. I don't want to do them. You sure? <laughs> yup. Look, look how sexy. If you want to do the manhole stopper, you're more than welcome to. Sexy, sexy. But that sounds like something that happens in prison, and I'd rather not be a part of it. Sexy, sexy. And frog? And frog. Oh, man, it's Halloween. I should totally, like, tweet that link to, like, the three new people who follow me on Twitter. What link? Oh, Sexy Sexy and Frog? Yeah, Nick's Costume Warehouse. Oh my god, you should totally do that. That's totally I feel like Nick I need to be using Twitter more, but I always forget to do it. So, like, yesterday after tweeting the Job of the Hut thing, I was like, I should do more of this. <laughs> Job of the Hut. Job of the Hut. Job of the Hut. <laughs> Job of the Hut. Job of the Hut. Anyone who's ever seen the Parks and Rec theme, just think Job of the Hut. It's... It's made for it. It's pretty funny. I yeah. like it. And I'm not a big Parks and Rec fan, so... How did I do that? How'd you land on the wall? Yeah, yeah that was not intentional. Question. He's level 94. That's fine. I mean, Zephyr's up to level 64. I think he's our highest currently, because all those grenade levels. Brad, Brad, Brad. Yeah, Hawkeye! Hawkeye! Woo! I almost feel like... So in, in some way that feels like like a spring break or something. It's like, <laughs> woo, Hawkeye! Hawkeye! <laughs> <laughs> Boobs. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, knocked off your shirt, Liam. Aw. At least give me some beads first. <laughs> These jokes are highly inappropriate. I don't know how my mom stands to watch these. I'm not good about <laughs> not being bad while recording these. Would, do you think she would be offended? Um, not like offended. More like embarrassed, probably. She still watches them. Well, yeah. she doesn't have to watch them in your presence. That would be worse. Yeah, that'd be worse. Although, like, due to family movie night, we've, we've had some awkward incidences. We watched, like, Dogville as a family. <laughs> right. Yeah, if you can get through Dogville as a family, you can get through anything. <laughs> Is that, is that how you test your family? Yeah. Aw, oh, you broke the limb like right before you would have gotten the bezel back for breaking that limb. <laughs> God damn it. I lost Leanne too. Harplunk! It's really funny that we've gotten to this point where uh, like those attacks like don't do it. Like it's like 700 damage and we're sort of like, okay. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> So why is it that Leanne's, like, health is so much lower than everyone's? I don't know. Oh, she's four levels lower. That shouldn't be that much health, should it? I don't know. I've never really paid attention to how much, like, health you get when you... Yeah, it sort of becomes irrelevant. For the most part. It's basically, like... The only thing that matters is, like, the meter. Like, the numbers almost don't mean anything. You know? Yeah, right. Alright, should win at this point. Just to be safe. What if they top deck removal? <laughs> Too late! Did we get Filthy what we pouch wanted? three! What did we want? Some hide? Uh. Oh yeah, these are those guys. Uh, vulcanized hide. It's the thing Not, we're looking for. Well, was it in Etsia or was it outside Etsia? It's probably in Etsia. Yeah. It doesn't really make much sense for this to be. But. 
He also told us to kill these guys. Those are two different Was it those though. things? Yeah, but like, was was it those things from upstairs that we're supposed to get him from? No, yeah, the no, yeah, this mission is for the guy. The mission to get stuff is from the woman. Yeah. But like, we're supposed to get them from. I don't think it's the manhole stoppers. It must be in Etsia. Etsia must be something like the Froud Remnants that has dungeons in it. Yeah. I really don't remember Etsia that well. Like, at I all. I think we called it Etpia. Etpia rings a bell. Either way, like, I don't. I just don't really remember what's supposed to go on there. Maybe when we, like, cover it in hexes, it'll, like, pop up and make sense. Maybe. So, is there just a leader? Yeah. It seems broken. I know. It seems to almost defeat the purpose of this. A little bit. Show me Hawkeye. Come on. I love like when he when he fires with like the two handguns. Like he holds the one behind his head at first, like he's lounging in midair. Yeah. <laughs> like he's literally like he's like chilling sideways on a couch, but like in the air. Oh yeah, you know. <laughs> Someone like calls him while he's doing that. Hey Vashron, what you up to? Oh, nothing much. <laughs> <laughs> Just some light guns. <laughs> yeah, it's like not even worth mentioning in this world. They're like, oh, you're gunsing, right? Yeah, yeah, guns. <laughs> yeah, yeah, guns. Are yeah, yeah, guns. Hmm. Hey, you know what we should do? What should we do? We should mention to people who, for some reason or other, only watch these that we started doing Minecraft. We did start doing Minecraft. Y'all should we watch it. We got 100 it. subscribers. Yeah. Which is like probably hard to miss if you go to our channel page because it's still like our featured video. I made a thing. It was a very cool thing. Yeah, you made a thing. And uh, so like now we're working on Minecraft. We have some ideas on things we could do with Minecraft. Minecraft's pretty cool. Like one of the nicest things about Minecraft is that you could basically do whatever. Yeah. And, like, we've, we've talked about Minecraft in the past, sort of in passing. Gives you a lot of flexible options. Yeah. You can do, like, adventure maps, like, pre-made, like, places, and do their challenges. I like that, like, some people have tried to incorporate, like, boss monsters into their, uh, adventure maps. Oh? I've seen a couple, like, decent ones. Like what? Um, someone once... Did a did a map where like there was like a spider boss and like each one of its legs had like a crystal thing, sort of like the Ender Dragon. How do you make that? I I don't know. I was really confused, but like super impressed. But like it was basically like there was one of those like healing crystals on each of its legs and like blowing each one up like set off like a redstone signal. Interesting. Uh, and then like when you hit all of those like it like opened a door or something so you could like leave. Weird. There have been some other even... ones. There's, there's like one I saw with like pistons that would like open these doors like on a timer, mm -hmm. so you'd have to try and like shoot a target inside. Yeah, those are cool. The ones that are, they like make bosses out of like inanimate objects. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are always really exciting to watch. I mean, it, it, to be clear, the spider boss did not move. It was a big spider statue that had those things and a bunch oh, of enemies around. Oh, them. oh. I thought it like, was like basically a... like it's like weak points where like those healing things and you'd break them. I got gotcha. you. All right, it looks like these are all the same too. So I'm gonna do these two, and then uh, yeah, meet you and this one is different, but they look the same. Last bullet. Is it just me? Yes. Or what? It's just you. I don't understand. I'm not sure I understand the name of that mission. Oh, I guess is it just me, or are these guys impossible to kill? Maybe. Cause like it was given to us by some guy who like wanted to kill them but he hired us to do it, so clearly he couldn't. That's my guess. We can go with that. I think that was a holster. I right, wanna play dress up? Wanna do another fashion montage? No. Fashion montage? I will slap you. Will, will you? I will. God, will you really? Damn it, I hate the fucking way they do this. I think there's actually a way to do it. Wait, rotate it back? Down. Uh, no, you're right. Whatevs. Alright, go to the place. To Etsia! Alright. 
start the fight already. What is this? It's fire Yeti? Heat Yeti. Yeti. Let's kill the Heat Yeti. I guess that's just like a higher level version of the Fire Yeti. It's only even level though, 71. Even though fire is sort of more intimidating than heat. Yeah, heat's just like... <laughs> the Humidity Yeti! <laughs> just stands around. Oh, it's guys. so annoying! <laughs> oh, God. It, it would be really funny if Humidity Yeti was like the max level <laughs> Yeti. Oh, God! But I wouldn't give her a dry heat yeti. <laughs> he recovers that scratch damage. Um. I don't know. You know, I don't remember that being as much of a thing in the last time we played through this game. It definitely felt less common. Like I feel like most of the enemies do it now. I don't think the enemies like scale. So even though we're a higher level, I don't think they're like. A higher level. I don't actually know about that. But like, it's one of the, like the, I feel like the biggest side effect of that is that it requires, it almost requires you to be using tri attacks because like, scratch damage isn't even effective enough. Scratch damage full. Like when they when they recover it that quickly and you're not level like 70, like you're just not dealing enough. Yeah. To, like, right. We got oh, a fabric all we got was scrap. a single fabric scrap. It was worth it. So, what are we looking for? Do we you are looking for vulcanized hide. Right, from what monster? Uh, the one. The one? Yeah, course. they said the name. See if it's in the mission memo, actually. We'll see who gets the last laugh. Last laugh! Oh yeah, we might actually want to rest. Did we actually take any poison damage from those, like, things? <laughs> Stop trying to save with your junk. <laughs> That's my thigh. Eh, it's the jungle region. <laughs> oh, wait, R, you said? Yeah, it looks like R is where the junker behemoth lives. Let's do it then. I mean, I totally remember off the top of my head. <laughs> it comes from, shut up. Just watch the video. Bazooka. Wait, was that a stiffy beer cat? Bazooka. No, it was a different kind of beer cat. Bazo bazooka beer cat. It's not as good. <laughs> <laughs> it's not as good when it's real words. The naming scheme in this game <laughs> is so fucking bizarre. It's really Japanese. The Japanese are really good at naming stuff. Yu-Gi-Oh cards have the best names of like any. <laughs> like like Magic's got got pretty cool stuff with their like, you know, thesaurus. They're like 80 different words for this guy does plants. <laughs> but like Yu-Gi-Oh, it's all just this guy does plants. <laughs> Blue eyes, white dragon. Well, yeah, but they also make it like as 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 like unnecessarily lengthy as possible. <laughs> right. I mean, one of my favorites is there's literally a card called uh, Black Luster Soldier Hyphen Envoy of the Beginning, <laughs> and he has a counterpart Chaos Dragon Hyphen like is it bringer of the end or is it Hawkeye? Like you you Hawkeye. Good job. How many rooms here? Two rooms? Yeah, I think we can handle this. I, I think I'm ready for this jelly. I don't know. <laughs> Are you? Are you Who really, though? I thought that that was, like, a good song lyric. I don't know. There's, there's like, no... Because, you know, like, okay, in, like, hip-hop songs, there's sort of, like, a language, you know? Right. Because, like, you know, sometimes they'll be, like, directly referencing another song or, like, some part of, like, the hip-hop mogul lifestyle that I don't understand. Like, popping bottles in the club and shit. <laughs> and then there's just like, I don't think you're ready for this jelly. What? No, I don't think I am. I think you're right about that. <laughs> I'm not, I don't think that's something <laughs> I want at all. It's a very astute observation you've, you've made. Like, I just, I just genuinely don't understand. Really don't. Because, like, it just doesn't, it, like, it doesn't sound like anything. It doesn't. Like, there's no... Even contextually, even with the context of the song, it's not clear what that means. Well, you I can think sort the, of I, infer... I think the jelly is her booty. Because it shakes yeah. like a bowl full of jelly? Yeah. Just to oh, make oh, it oh, oh, Christmassy, oh. I guess? Christmas is coming. Yeah. I'm not sure Christmas will actually come today. What do you think? I don't know, maybe. Not really my kind of <laughs> the best triangle. 
We've done way worse than that. That's not even... It's not even really close to the worst. Bam! I like that he's like shooting the thing airborne without looking at it. Because he's like sliding along the ground. He's like, yeah. I don't even need to look at this it's to fine. shoot it in it's the over air. there, whatever. Like, it'd be one thing if it was on the ground, because you could sort of just like spray the bullets back and forth with the scratch damage gun. But like, it's really funny when he's doing it in the air. He's like, no, I know exactly where it is. It's <laughs> hard. <laughs> Alright. Shooting things airborne with bullets isn't rocket science. Oh, it's a man truck. It is a man truck. To I'm gonna do your move. It won't work exactly the same way, but it could work out. Give it a shot. See what happens. He's level 97. He's gonna regenerate that scratch damage. Are you still on fire? No, you're not. Oh, I'm on fire. For some reason, it, it, for a split second, it looked like you had the fire icon on. I'm like, I didn't think that type of effect persisted between rooms. Oh, shit. How bad is this gonna be? He hurt himself. He... He did that. He may have done 3,000 damage to his face. And that's what happens every time I sneeze, I'll tell you what for. <laughs> I think I should see a doctor. I agree with that. <laughs> oh, there's a box and a spider. I didn't notice the spiders, did you? Of course there's a spider. There's always a spider. It's not always a spider, but there was a spider with him last time, so it does stand to reason. Oh, there's a spider. Oh, there, there's two spiders. There are, in fact, two spiders. Mm. Yeah, you might as well target it. He's just gonna recover the scratch damage. How do I want to do this, though? Yeah, I think that's the way to go. Zephyr still has to go, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's. I think that's good. Oh yeah. See, now you wish you had targeted the other guy. <laughs> Yeah, right? But of course, by cosmic law, if you had targeted the other guy, you would have been condition critical by the end of this turn. Right. BAM! See, aren't you glad we have the grenade what thing the fuck? going? There we go. There it is. Oh yeah, this will work. <laughs> <laughs> Not really his kind of weapon. We'll see who gets the last laugh. Last laugh. Last laugh. I don't know why he says it that way. <laughs> I'm not even actually sure if that's been on camera. Because, like, that, he only does that when you run away from a fight. Yeah, it's true. But, like, I feel like every time we're, like, running from a fight with Vacheron, like, we get him to the edge of the room and he's like, let's see who gets the last laugh. Last laugh. So, like, when we're trying to, like, travel between floors, we'll hear it, like, seven times in a row. <laughs> let's do this. Seven resonance points is a good amount. Is that a ramp over there? Oh, no, it's a spider. Yeah, that's good. What? How did I... Oh, he got stuck in the corner there? Oh, that's good. That's... Alright, so it's gonna be seven resonance points of just scratch damage. Well... Oh, uh, or not. Well, let's see. Maybe Leanne will just go to town? Nope. Wow, that, that went... That was a huge... Not good. Huge waste of everything. Was it a waste of space? It was a waste of pretty much everything. But was it a waste of space? Well, space is part of everything, so yes. Well, no, see, I'm trying to discount it by, by finding something that it's not a waste of. So you need to actually answer the question. Yes. Waste of space? Yes. Uh, let's see, was it a waste of carbon? I used to hear that a lot in high school. Alright, let's try that yeah, again. Yeah, let's check this. Yeah, that was cool. Glad that I've... All right, second up. try, second try. <laughs> second try is the betterment, so I guess I got one more after this. <laughs> Maybe it'll be like very betterment. Ooh, that would be a good name for like a toothpaste flavor. Very betterment. Well, you know, be betterment. <laughs> yeah, I like it. Um, I think I was telling you this recently. We've probably forgotten it anyway. What? Whoa! All what right. What the glorious hell just happened? That we didn't make any sense. We just straight up lost in one like, hit. In one shot. One hit kill. Like the two subsequent explosions did enough damage. It must have been the end. Everyone else has too much health to get killed, even by two. Oh, that's weird. So third tries the charm. Yeah. 
Unless this kills us. No, wait, the end goes first. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I don't understand what's happening. I can't wrap my this brain is, uh, around this. This is nonsense. going. This is going pretty well. Oh my god. So I'm just gonna keep doing this until that doesn't happen, I guess. What? What? I don't I don't know what to, I don't know what to tell you. That is that was the difference. That was the difference. Because before it was trying to target her and those last two times it was targeting one of them. Yeah, right. And it kills both of them apparently. So apparently that what? <laughs> <Did you laughs> see that? that was pretty stupid. In this in this world, just nothing phases anyone. Cause it's pure nonsense. They're like, oh look, it's like a face falling from the sky. Whatever. <laughs> face made of scrap metal. Speaking of faces, have you seen this guy's face? He looks like a fish. He looks different. I think I actually remember the other face. Uh, I haven't noticed it today though. Uh, but the thing I was saying is that uh, this is completely random. It seems even more random now. Uh, but like, I, I, I used to buy toothpaste solely based on the name of the flavor, because everything is basically stripe flavor. <laughs> stripe flavor, right? Which is a reference I stole, but I think it's very apt. Um, but like, basically all toothpaste is generically mint with a green stripe in it. Right. Um, but I used to get, was it Aquafresh, I think? And they had Empowerment. <laughs> Empowerment! And, uh, clearly you were forced to purchase it. Oh yeah, I mean, it was just such a good name, and it's like, there's just so few factors actually determining, like, what, like, which toothpaste I want to buy. So it's like, this one has a fucking awesome name, <laughs> I'm gonna buy Empowerment. And then they, like, discontinued it after, like, a year. Oh. So, like, I refuse to buy from that brand at all now. Because, like, they replaced it with something that, like, tastes exactly the same, but, like, just doesn't have a good name at all. What was that? What happened? Uh, I think something tried to shoot me and then it ended up killing itself. Because it was super scratched. Yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> well, alright then. Alright, it's not going to happen this time. As you have, can you, have you ever tried see. cinnamon toothpaste? Uh, no, it sounds gross. Yeah, I, I, I know that that's basically the alternative to striped toothpaste, but I've never tried it. It sounds way too intense. Yeah. Because, like, cinnamon is inherently kind of intense. And, like, Pretty some toothpaste can be kind of intense. Yeah. So, like... <laughs> Hawkeye. Hawkeye. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh, yeah. He he does have a very, like, uh, Creature from the Black Lagoon face. Yeah. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, like that old, like, universal monster. Yeah. Yeah. I hear that uh, Universal Studios is doing like a Halloween thing and they have like Silent Hill as like part of their park right now. Oh, really? Yeah. That sounds creepy. Yeah, it sounds friggin' terrifying. Bam! Vulcanized hide. Whoa! Oh my god, that's gross! What? Why is that happening? What happened to it? Oh my god. It's still here. It, it had to stop spazzing out. What did you want to do? Give it a high five? <laughs> yeah. What, what, were you, what was the goal there? There was a box there. Here. Was I guess totally it got about, destroyed. It, it must have blown up. Oh well. That's annoying. It's I fine. hate that. Whatever. I don't ever remember that happening in a battle other than that one room in like the forest of idols that's surrounded by explosive barrels. Yeah, right. It's like what, impossible. What turned out to be in there? Do we remember? <sighs> we like figured it out. It was like stupid. Like it was just like completely pointless. There's like no point to that room. Cause like it takes a tremendous deal of effort not to blow that up. Right, right, right. Like, it took me, like, over a dozen tries to simply get through that room without blowing that thing up. Alright, so we got the thing. We gotta uh, take that. Okay, so let's go to Albona and check in with that guy, check the boards, and then sort of regroup. Okay? Sounds good. See you outside! Boo 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 boo! Wait, seriously? Alright. We can do it. Alright, so all we have to do is turn in the hide to the lady, and now go see this guy on in Cranktown. Yeah, so I guess we could do that. Meet you there. Alright, we're here. Find a scientist. Are you science? Which one of you... Wait, ask about beakers. I think you passed him. Did I? I think it was him. Oh, yeah, there he is. 
Adams and shit. You look like hunters. I'd like someone to go pick up some books. Actually, a set of pharmacological text. Pharmacology text. Shh, fine. Uh, from my doctor friend, Warden, at Gorliff 2. He's loaning them to me, you see. If you're not busy, could you get to do that for me? Could I get you to do that for me? Why would you pay money to have someone do this for you? I know. Doesn't uh, everyone in this world just have, like, six handguns on them at all times? <laughs> to Corliff 2. Warden. Might be upstairs. Oh, it's probably upstairs. Fuck you. The <laughs> guy, like, couldn't stand to wait for the elevator. So he, like, hires you. Hugo! Up the I can't be asked to wait here. Oh, yeah, this is clearly... <laughs> it's clearly this guy. It's clearly this guy. What? Don't do my pharmacology text. Oh, Stanley sent you. These are books here. You can take them. <laughs> it's like a weird German Sean Connery. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, so, Tech, my comment as we were leaving town actually made me think of something. Mm-hmm. Imagine how horrible it must be. You know, we talked about trying to arrange a flight to the sky town of Basel. Yeah, right. But, like, imagine, like, TSA procedures in a world where everyone has so many guns. <laughs> everyone would have to be subjected to a strip search at all times. Oh, my God, that'd be terrible. You'd basically have to walk around the airport naked. <laughs> all right, we're going to go up and turn in that last uh, little bit of the quest, and then it's Christmas time. <laughs> I would call this Christmas Eve. Which one do I want? Uh, down. That one. This one? No, no, this, this one? one. Oh, yeah? Are you sure? Dang show. Boom, nailed it. Well done. Alright. I have really good game instincts in general. Apparently. I like... I just like osmosis information, and then, like, <laughs> know it by feel. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Here's your shit. Oh, that's vulcanized hide, isn't it? Goody! Now I can get back to getting that outfit ready. We got a shockproof suit. I like that she gives you clothes. That makes sense. Like, yeah. It's kind of a nice flavor thing, I guess. All right, join us uh, next week yeah, for looks, looks like Christmas. Our, looks like our Christmas preparations took a little longer than expected. Christmas! But hopefully you've enjoyed Christmas. It's Christmas time, you guys! Shh, Santa knows when you're awake.